Welcome back to Season 2 of eMarketing. It's only taken four takes to get this far into the slide deck. It is week seven. We are back in action. The seminars are back on on the Monday and the Tuesday. And we are going to hit a couple of major milestones. So first of all, the on-demand lectures this week are going to be about audio and video. We are separating the two functions and we're focusing in the on-demand lectures around the audio-centric sites. But what you'll see when you watch the on-demand series is we're now drawing on all the theoretical frameworks that we set up in the first six weeks. So if you're finding it a bit confusing and you're not sure what we're talking about when we're talking about the various pricing, distribution, value co-creation opportunities, go back and revisit the marketing mix videos and you'll see the frameworks that we're laying out here are now being applied to understand and work through the different platforms. The other thing I want to say about the on-demand content is we're now into the self-service, it's your responsibility end of the season. I know you've got other things on. I know you've got three other subjects as well as me. But here's the thing. If you elect to opt out of using the on-demand content, that is your choice and I will respect it. But I will want you to respect that choice so that when we get to the end of the season, and you're doing the student evaluations of the subject, if you've opted out of consuming the content, then I want you to think about that and the feedback you provide. If you chose not to use the systems that are available, I have no problem with that. I just want you to have that. Don't come back at the end of the season and go, well, he didn't force me to do my homework. That's the only trade-off is you are responsible adults. It's a busy life. There's a plague running rampant through the nation at the moment. Life's kind of complex and difficult, so if you choose to opt out, I'll respect it, but you've got to take your consequences of that opt out, and you can't come back to me afterwards and go, hey, it's not fair, I didn't do any of the work, and I didn't get any of the benefits. So co-creation is a two-way street here. If you choose not to co-create, then you choose not to access the value. And again, I'm okay with that if you're okay with that. So, on demand, the other thing to be conscious of in the on demand is that there is a training element. At the far end of each of the videos, there is a breakdown and a discussion of a conceptual theoretical paper. The reason I am doing that is to give you an opportunity to look at how to use a reading. As well as teaching you e-marketing, I'd like to give you a couple of techniques that you can carry over into your next season's worth of studies. So if this is your final semester, glad to have had you on board. If you've got another semester or two semesters or maybe even four semesters to go, have a look at the way we're doing this. Have a look at the way we're teaching how to use a piece of theory, how to use a, an academic article, how to draw out an idea and apply an idea because that's what I'm going to want you to do in the final assessment task in the performance review. So I'm going to give you some practice. I'm going to give you some opportunities to look into these papers. And also I picked papers I thought were kind of interesting, had interesting ideas on. That's why they're there. Now the other thing about weeks 7 through to week 11 is these are weeks that are not directly necessarily attached to your project. So if you're doing TikTok, you're going to be going, oh, video, awesome, that's relevant to me, I'll go pick that up. Yeah, TikTok, Insta, and YouTube. But if you're looking at this going, oh, look, I'm not doing SoundCloud, so I can probably skip audio. What I'm looking at is giving you the opportunity to expand the repertoire, to be able to go beyond merely focusing on just your assignment got to do the thing, the thing for my assignment, the assignment project that I'm doing, into, hey, the internet's a big place and I want to learn. I came here to e-marketing to learn about e-marketing. What's the available option sets? What's out there? What can I explore and chase? So expand the repertoire is a fancy way of get it there and do stuff. Uh, the seminars, the live action seminars, we are going to do a couple of applied events during those. 
We are going to do a discussion around how the project went for you over the semester break, and that's training towards the portfolio. And we're going to do some elements around how can we use features like audio, how can we use features like video to expand and enhance our projects. So what I'm interested in giving you, because I've asked you to create live, real projects, projects that you want to pursue, this is about going beyond the assignment. This is about extending up and saying, my project is real. I want to see what can I do with audio in my project? What can I do with video in my project? How can I enhance and expand what I'm trying to achieve here? So that's in play. Uh, seminars back in business, tutorials are back on, forum participations back in game, and welcome back, mate. It's uh, going to be an interesting second half of the season. And here's hoping it's going to be interesting in the, hey, wow, that was really great and I really enjoyed it, rather than interesting in the, oh, God, oh, God, we're going to die format of interesting. So best of luck and uh, see you in the seminars.